I've been opening some boxes on my own, and I'd like to show you some of my biggest pulls, and I'd like to show you actually my all-time new favorite foil treatment that they've done here. And I have a few to show you. I'm taking them out of their sleeves because this is now my all-time fave new foil they've done, and it's brand new for this set. Textured foil, I think? It's confusing. There's a lot. This is my favorite foiling Magic's ever done, and I don't even know how it's going to appear on camera. I'm going to do my best to show you. This, all, all of that, like all those lines you see there, you can feel all of it. These are super rare. Only pull a couple of these, uh, and I'm hearing that they're not a lot of them at all. I love it. I'll show you another one. This one's like red aesthetic, but, and it's crackle with power. And then we have overwhelming forces. Look, it just, it looks like, this has the monopoly on the greatest foiling treatment I've ever seen. It's so fitting for the aesthetic. It looks like old timey. It looks rugged, it looks cowboy, but, that's not even the most value. There is a slightly more valuable foil treatment that they've done here called raised foil. And I pulled this, of course, I pulled it off stream. So I just showed you what the mana drain could look like. It's that type of foil. These ones have normal foiling, they have non-foil, and then they have something called raised foil. Yes, it is very confusing, but I did pull a raised foil one and uh, well, I'll just show it to you now. Yeah, it's kind of the juiciest card in the whole set. So if you see the foiling here, it's actually textured on these little edges and it's raised and it's really cool looking. I like the etched one more, but this is uh, the most valuable card I think currently. Sword of Wealth and Power. For those who don't know, by the way, let me read you what this does because this is gonna be like a guaranteed auto include and I think a lot of dicks. This card shouldn't be made. A quick creature gets plus two, plus two, and has protection from instants and sorceries. Uh, whenever a quick creature deals combat damage to a player, create a treasure token. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell this turn, copy that spell. You may choose new targets for the copy. All right, there's no drawbacks. Why does this card exist? And I got it in the best foiling. So the goal for tonight is to pull another one. All right, let's just get started. We have six boxes to get through. We might start getting degenerate if we don't get good pulls. All right, I've opened a bunch of these, so we're going to go slow for you guys. I will say I haven't looked at any of the commons or commons yet. All right, here we go. The first card I think is the best possible slot. Not what we're looking for, though. Villainous Wealth. This is the prosperity cards. These are the cards that can come in the um, the textured. This, is the sp this becomes this when it's get the special treatment, and we're hoping for at least one. 3x seems too much. Is it though? This seems expensive to cast. Void Slime. I don't think TTS is on. Not for 200 bits. Pyretic Charge. Discard your hand, then draw four cards. For each card discarded this way, creatures... What? That's pretty good. Guys, argument at my table. Settle it. Nobody wants to look it up because we're lazy. Is Tiny Bones a baby? I say yes. Tiny Bones has to... Okay, let me ask you. If he's not a baby, how do we get a Tiny Bone? You're saying he's smoking a cigar? Brother, it's bones that have been reanimated. I don't care what he does. He has no lungs. Pitiless Carnage, Decisive Denial. Back for more. And then What's he gonna land. do, die again? <laughs> this might be my favorite since Ixalan. These lands are gorgeous. First off, for all my two-eyed viewers, you probably noticed that you can see the forest symbol nicely, subtly hidden within the cacti. This is the best land I've ever seen. If you don't like the forest, give it a chance. There's, there's way better ones too. All right, I haven't really looked at the commons or uncommons. If there's anything I miss here, let me know. Luxurious Locomotive. I don't like any uh, vehicle decks or anything vehicle related. Does anyone run a good vehicle deck? Because they're not good. Sorry. Jagged Barons. We'll be looking Tumbleweed at Rising. Jailbreak Scheme. Gold Pan. When Gold Pan enters the battlefield, create a treasure token. Okay. Are your boxes American or Japanese factory? How do I find that out? If you could tell me how to find that out, I'll, I'll figure it out. Here we go. Big pull. Here it is. Ah, uh, pest infestation. Uh, back of the booster will tell the uh, opening. Loose wrapping on packs, rares in front, Japanese. It says it so on the Japanese bottom made? of the cardboard. It will say made in USA or in Japan. The Japanese Where? ones are usually rare in the Tehi front and better quality cardboard. These are rare in front. These are these are rare in front. Is this it? Humiliate. Oh, this poor guy. He's all tangled up. There's so many reprints in this set, too, that are just so good. So come on, boys. You, how can you tell me these don't look banger, bro? Lava Spur Boots. Look at him. New Boot Goofin. Free Strider Commando. Bridled Bighorn. It's a sheep mount. This set added uh, uh, mounts, and I kind of like it. Uh, Daring Thunder Thief. And it's another mount. There you go. See? Okay, you can saddle them. Tap any number of other creatures you control with power one or more. This mount becomes saddled to end a turn. Saddle as a sorcery. They're worse vehicles? I th Are they worse? I thought they were better. Also on the it says made in Japan below it. Made in Where? Japan. 
or USA on the bottom left. Oh, on the back. made in Japan. Japan packs. You Yo. got me back into magic after Yo. 10 plus years. Is that good? Um, I went to my first pre-release this weekend and pulled Ooh. the tiny bones and had so much fun. So is it Thanks, a baby? Papa is Can it I a have baby? a kiss? Oh, okay. So this is the, uh, what is it called? Big score, whatever. These are like rare. I don't even know how this shit works, but why did this guy get so much hate? This guy's name loot. Everyone hates him. This is a big hit. I, what's wrong with him? He's loot. He's cute. Electro dominance. I love the way these cards look. It's so cool. Bounty board from the commander set. Arc, arc mage newt. All right, I got my mount. first paycheck from my new job and you f know it. I'm buying magic like nobody's business. Hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah. Terminal Agony. Look at how good that looks. Oh. Skewer the Critics. Am I right? That's going to be me on May. Ooh, woo! Con Congregation Griff. Another mount. So many mounts. I got to make a mount deck. But you know what? You guys kind of turned me off of it a little bit. You're like, oh, so I'm that guy's uh, boss vehicles at are his better. job. And uh -huh. I'm firing him now that I, I know that's what he's wasting his money on. <laughs> I'm heading back to Ireland tomorrow to see my girlfriend. We've been long distance the past two years. Oh, on good Wednesday. for you. Vehicles are literally better. Mounts are better because they don't need other creatures to be a creature. That's what I was thinking, right? So the, the saddle mechanic, the, the creature functions as a creature, whereas like vehicles, they just sit there like doofus dog shit idiots. Am I wrong? Here we go. Three, two, one. Okay, here's a great example. This is why these are better than vehicles. It enters, it's a creature, it'll still be a creature. It's not just an artifact sitting off to the side. If I never saddle this, it's still a 2-4 with an ETB of scry 2. How is that not better? Someone help me out. Like, really though, help me out. Is it not a good mechanic? Vehicles are resistant to board wipes. Destroy all, fade from history. Not better, just different. There's so much more creature removal than artifacts, so it's a trade. Fell the mighty. Angelic sellsword. Ooh. Oh, Jace is good. I believe Jace is a big hit. This is that new, new Jace. Dr Jace reawaken. This is that new, new Jace. Let's see what he does. I don't actually know what he does. Two drop, two blue. You can't cast a spell during your first, second, or third turn. I wonder why that is. That's such a weirdly, like, specific... Something must have happened in playtesting. And they were like, stop, stop, stop. He's broken. Stop. Uptick, draw a card, then discard a card. Uptick again, you may exile a non-land card with mana value three from your hand. If you do, it becomes plotted. What does plotted mean? Pay now, cast later. Until the end of turn for minus six. Until the end of turn, uh, whenever you cast a spell, copy it. You mean, okay, that's crazy. Oh, this is broken. <laughs> it doesn't even matter that you can't play it till the fourth turn. Who gives a f Oh, that's kind of crazy for two. Wow, we're gonna put that in the nice good keep pile. World Wake Walker Helm. This is also from the big score. You can see the set symbols difference is big down there. Uh, if you would create one or more artifact tokens, instead create those tokens plus an additional map token. <laughs> map is so boring. I don't know, oh God. If you run a clue token deck, you're dead to me. Nobody cares. Buried in the, buried in the garden. Oh, mountain looks good. I don't like maps at all. I'm so dumb. Yo, it's this guy. He's a little axolotl bear commander. I read about this guy. Uh, spells you cast from your graveyard or from exile cost two less. Kind of good. Plotting cards from your hand cost two less. Kind of good. Kind of good. Kind of fun. There's a new Obeka in here, and I want you to know if anyone... I'll show you when she comes up. If anybody makes the Obeka deck, you are gamma levels of cringe. I already have it made. That's your... You are... The readings are off the charts for how cringe you are. Obeka might be one of the most cringe commanders in Magic, and the new one is just like you don't you don't want to play. You want your friends to watch you solitaire out the game. Deep Muck Desperado. This is kind of a cool looking card. Forlorn Flats. We're still going slow while we're looking at these. Ooh, I made a zombie deck, and I took a lot of zombie cards from this set. I made a banger zombie deck too. Also, I gotta be real. Zombie decks go accidentally infinite way too easily. Why does, what is it called? Gr grave, grave crawler? That one that's a one drop that lets you cast from the grave? I'm sorry. Why does that exist? Phyrexian altar, cool. Infinite ETBs, like it's so ridiculous. Why does that exist? It is cool. It's a, the it's a, it's a flavor W. Oh, I got so excited. Bony Paul, clear cutter. Is that a big old ghost cow in the background? When Bonnie Pal clear cutter enters the battlefield, create a Create bow. You create a blue ox named bow? Creature token, this creature's power and toughness equals to the number of lands you control. Oh, this is so fun. 
Uh, whenever you attack, draw a card. You may put a land from your hand or the graveyard onto the battlefield. Ooh! This is the answer to all you Obeka cringe lords. This is good, honest magic. I like it a lot. Uh, Siphon Insight. So far, no huge hits yet. Ooh, Tower Winder. It's a Reach Snake Death Touch. Uh, whenever Tower Winder enters the battlefield, search your library and or graveyard for a card named Command Tower. What? Oh, what? What? <laughs> what? I'm sorry, what? This is just a Command Tower Fetcher? I'm in disbelief that this... What? Cool. All right. I like it. Ooh, this was a cute one. Cute little commander I saw. Rush of Dread. Yeah, I haven't read most of these yet, um, so it's cool to, like, slow down and read them. Humiliate again. You guys don't like these lands? Oh, how bitter are you guys? We need to just put a little love back in the world. This is... Ugh. Betrayal the Vault. Neutralize the guards. Oh! It's hey, a rambling possum. The Assassin's Creed set coming out in I'm going to be Fears Leonardo motherfucking Da Vinci, I bro. I already, I'm making a Leo <sighs> deck. That's all. That's my opinion. Rambling possum. Mine Raider. Ew. Frog Beast. Um, whenever Spring Splasher attacks target, target creature defending player controls gets minus. Nah, that wouldn't help me in my deck. Okay, and Desert Charizard D. clears all these, followed by the five pieces of Exodia Nerd. Move five off to the side. So from here, do I go one, two, like five from the bottom? Okay, how? What are you considering the bottom? Token side bottom. Okay, okay. So so one. This has texture. This has texture. This has texture. I feel the texture. One, two, three, four, five. Oh sh. Okay, now what? Not including the target. Now what? Now what? Now what? Two to the back. One, two. Okay. Then the five to the back. Okay. So we should be looking at uncommons or a land. All right. Here we go. Planes. Cool. There is a textured. I felt the texture. So get excited, boys. Prosperity Tycoon. Bovine Intervention. I really want to make an ox deck with that new ox commander. I kind of love the theme of it. I'll show you when we get it. Boombox. <laughs> Failed fording. Conduit pylons. Phantom interface. Where, oh, I see texture coming up. Armored armadillo. Oh, Lord have mercy. He's got ward. Is that his armor? Texture's coming up. Textured after this card, I think. It's okay. Here we go. Texture. I think texture. Three, two, one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't have this one. I don't know if this is a good one. Ooh. We pulled one. Huge, by the way. Huge. Very rare. This is a fractured identity. I recognize the card name. Exile target, non land permanent. Each player, other than its controller, creates a copy, a token that's a copy of it. Ooh. Ooh, that's toxic. Only 25 for this. Oh, man. It's still really pretty, though. I can barely even tell what the art is for this. I know there's like a like a couple birds on it. Well, that's cool. That's a big hit. We'll take it. Cruel Ultimatum, another big hit. Well, a, a good card at least. Cactus Preserve. It enters tap. Add one mana of any type that you can... Okay. Until the end of turn, Cactus Preserve becomes an XX green plant with reach, where X is the greatest mana among your commanders. Hmm. Weird. Ooh, another big. Bristlebud Farmer. He's a plant druid. And Annie joins up. We got a textured foil. Okay. I will take that. Bristlebutt is insane, by the way. I haven't read it. Let's take a look. Okay, trample. Four drop, trample, five, five. Uh, when Bristlebutt enters the battlefield, create two food tokens. This is already broken. That's so much. Whenever it attacks, you may sacrifice a food. If you do mill three cards, you may put a you may put a permanent card from among them into your hand. What? This is so good. There's so much value on this. Four mana, trample, two food on ETB. On attack, more value. Well, all right. All right, let's see if I can remember the card trick Peanut just taught us, because that was, I'm not going to lie, kind of a nightmare. So we do token. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, five. Should be a land. Yeah, you know your boy's got that f memory. Yeah, baby. Forest. Don't care. Okay, we got a little, some sort of native-looking gentleman flying. Cool, don't care. Red Rock Sentinel. Beastbound Outcaster. Holy cow! I love this card. It's very cool. It's cute. Got the memory, but not the eyesight. That's all right. Prickly Pear. That was mean. Spinewood Paladin. 
Oasis Gardener. Is this a little naked man? What is this? You guys are going to have to be my eyes for me. See for me. Sing to me, Palo. Heartless Pillage. Thornado. You have superpowers? I didn't see what you said, Ash. That's unfortunate. Three, two, one. Oh, oh. It's an ornery tumble wag. Imagine losing the game to an ordinary tumble wag. At the beginning of combat on your turn, put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature. When he attacks while saddled. Oh, it's another mount. Double the number of plus ones on target creature. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, there's a good hit. Oh, <laughs> I've definitely won a game with this card before. Oh, we would also like one of these in the uh, textured foil. Banger. This card bangs. Looking sharp, my dude. Thank you. That's a big hit. We take those. Sand Scout. Gold Vein Hydra. X and a green. Vigilance. Trample. Haste. Gold Vein Hydra enters the battlefield with X plus one. one. Okay, so you can pay for its power and toughness. When it dies, create a number of tap tra Yo. Yo, what is going on with green? They're getting juiced. Oh! Yes! Big hit too! Okay, that's Lotus Ring. Lotus Ring is absurd. I, I, this is huge. This is a good, huge pull. This has been a great box. God damn. Indestructible. Shouldn't be. Three drop. Equip creature gets plus three, plus three. Has vigilance and tap. Sacrifice this creature at three mana of any one color. Yes, the equip cost is three, but this is so broken. You can break this card so easily. If you can cheat the equipment cost, it's insane. My dog barked over your answer. Which clear sleeves do you use? <laughs> Two. I don't know if I want to do it this way because then I feel if there's texture. Okay, Swamp. We got it. Miriam. Herd Whisper. Nope. Tomb Trawler. Nope. Unfortunate Accident. Oh, is she trapped on the railroad? Lonely Arroyo. Bandit. Cacti Cactarantula. Oh, good heavens. Oh, good heavens. Peerless Rope Master. Tyrant Scorn. And for our possible foil, nope, <clears throat> Abrupt Decay, not a bad card. Detention Sphere, Arcane Heist. That guy's dog here. Bark, 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 bark. Hey, I'm that guy's Good dog. One. I did it again. You might want to tell him one more time. All right, maybe we do a mega pack of it. I don't want to feel though. I can see, I can instantly feel, and I know this doesn't have it. I do, I do like turning it over and it's instantly the land. That's kind of cool, but I don't like that I can feel shoot the sheriff i don't like that i can feel it it ruins it for me um i think this one's texture guys ankle biter and it has death touch little tip newcomer give your boots a shake in the morning before you put them on and frank to kellen discerning peddler can i interest you in some herbs from nakanu naka to nakanami fresh from the almond path or a set of Fjorin cookware? Finest in the multiverse. And Frank to Helen Keller. Brittle pack. Journey to nowhere. And texture. Nope. Annie joins up. All right, Annie. Nobody f***ing asked you. Primal Might. Give me a mana drain. Thunderclap Drake. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So here is the big loot alt we're looking for. The showcase. Not the foil. Not the raised foil, but you get to see it now. Hostile Investigator. When Hostile Investigator enters the battlefield, target opponent discards a card. Whenever one or more players discard one or more cards, investigate. I'm going to do it this way, and I'm going to try not to feel if it's textured. Okay, so we're going to do this. I'm going to do it. Okay, I'm just going to touch right up here. I can't tell. And then let's go through this pack. We're going to do a textured only pack. Here we go. All right, Abrupt Decay. Vengeful Regrowth. It's a commander. Hell to Pay. It's a cool looking card. Hellpay deals X damage to target creature. Create a number of tap treasure tokens equals the amount of excess damage dealt to. What? What the? F this just feels so. Why do we? Do we don't need to give them treasure. Fun crow. Get... Uh, yeah. The card souvenir snatcher is traced off of a photography by Dr. Kaylee Swift of a crow having sex with a taxidermied crow. What? Uh, and then the commons. I won't even waste too much time on these. We've been through a lot of these. Ooh, this is steer clear. Steer clear deals two damage to target attacker or blocking creature. Steer clear deals four damage to that creature. If you can control the mount. Oh, they want us to use mounts. All right, here. Ooh, just bent the shit out of the card in the back. That's how you know I know what I'm doing. Drop the textured one right there. Ready, flip. And we have Art Me Charm. 
Gray Waters Fixer. Each outlaw creature card in your graveyard has Encore X, or X is the man of value. Well, great train heist. That's a lot. Of, wait, does this card have a backside? Nope. Why does it have a plus? Is the plus mean spree? I guess so. Vis, vis, vr, Raska, the silencer. Love you, say it back. I love you too, and I love the new art for Fling. It's sick. I don't have to die to a f football now, so that's exciting. Form a posse! Posse is a confusing word, and if English isn't your first language, I feel ya. Can I recommend a good cowboy song? You can do whatever you want. Man, I'm gonna put that there. Okay, I don't think we got anything textured. I'm not gonna. Whoa! Crime and punishment? Put target creature or enchantment card from an opponent's graveyard onto the battlefield under your control. That seems a little, um, seems a little expensive. Let's see what the punishment is. Destroy each artifact, creature, and enchantment with mal mana value of X. I'm not that impressed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be real. I'm not that impressed. Kitty, talented sprout. This is the alt uh, commander, right? That's kind of a cute card. It's crazy. You have to cut the card in half every time you want to play it. Yeah. Uh, bird rogue. It's been a rough mating season for bird person. Botanical sanctum. Fierce retribution. Essence capture. The land, the beautiful land. All right, here we go. The Mega Pack. It's only three cards. It probably won't be sh because I felt them already. Glizzy. Ooh, Assimilation Aegis. Am I saying that right? I don't know. A lot of words. Someone can read it. Ah, <sighs> three steps ahead. We'll take anything. Give us a mythic. Give us a mythic. Now, boys, I will say, we've looked at the set. I've shown you the cards. We can get a little degenerate. I think we should. A second box has hit the stream. Yes, sir. So what was our biggest pull? We pulled a Mind Break Trap. We pulled a Textured Foil. Not the biggest Textured Foil. The, not the best. day you buy only one collector box is the day I eat my shoe. Oh, okay. I Yeah, I hear you. Three, two, one. Give me something big. First pack, new box. Boom. Pest Infestation. Piece of sh**. Pariah. Don't care. Thunder clap. I'll read what it does now. I just spit. Flying. Instant and sorcery spells cost one less. Cool. You can pay two and a blue. Sacrifice it when you cast the next instant or sorcery spell this turn. Copy it for each time you've cast your... Ooh. Okay. That actually ain't bad. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Ooh. Kellen the kid. I hear this is a good commander. Dude has an energy sword. He does. He does. Riku of many paths. Repulse. Humiliate the land. I don't care about the commons anymore. If you care about the commons, you're in the wrong stream. Okay, we're not here for the commons. We don't care because we're going to pull something crazy right here. Focus, focus, focus. Boom. Okay. Okay. I don't think this is super value, but I like it. It's a good card. It's Bruvac. Yeah, I'm a Bru Bru Bruv idiot. Jackie Chan. Ooh, I wanted to make this a deck. I wanted to soup up the, com the new commander deck. This will never hit the table. No one's gonna let this play. First off, the art is gorgeous, but look what it does. Spells you cast but don't on cost one less. Okay, sick, right? Super good. Whenever one or more creatures you control deal combat damage to a player, look at the top card of the target of that player's library, then exile it face down. You would play that card. Nobody likes people doing that. It's like it just this deck, I'm sorry. Don't get got by this. No one's gonna let this play. Everyone target targets you. Oh, there he is! Hey, but he's not foil. It's not what we're looking for. Loot the key to everything. What does this guy even do? He has Ward 1. At the beginning of your upkeep, exile the top X cards of your library, where X is the number of card types among other non-land permanents you control. You may play one of those cards this turn. Is this good? I don't know that this is good. It can be. I don't know. It seems kind of boring. It seems kind of boring. All right, here we go. Texture. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, focus on me. Esoteric Duplicator. How's that for reading? Uh, whenever you sacrifice Esoteric Duplicator or another artifact, you may pay two. If you do, at the beginning of the next end step, create a token that's a copy of it. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, okay. Okay. I see some synergy. Okay. Hey, there we go. Another archive trap. Lock and load. Draw a card, then draw a card for each other instant and sorcery you've cast. There's our boy, a loyal steed. Hell to pay. We've seen you. Okay, Terminal Agony. Oh, whoa, hey! Forest and the Commons. 
So breakable with Crank Clan Iron. Bro, you're spitting right now. Oh, stupid f owl. Don't care. Oh, Oko. Hate this card. Stop printing this card. Broco. Real, though. Oh, he's so broken. I hate him. I hate this card. Carlos is the only one at the table who plays this card, and that's because Carlos is Omega Cringe. The texture foil is like 100 bucks. Yep. Yep. This is the guy. I want to make a deck with this guy. I love it. I love Ox Tribal. It's so cool. Oxy and have double strike. Banger. Uh, whenever Bruce Tarl, roving rancher, enters the battlefield or attacks, exile the top card of your library. If it's a land, create a 2-2 two -two ox. Awesome. Otherwise, you may cast it. Love it. Love it. Ah, cool. The unrepentant. Cringe. Murder. Hey, Wubby, what do you do after stream when you put up the cards? I feel like it's the end of the Indiana Jones movies where you're wheeling a cart to a warehouse where you put up your cards in a crate. <laughs> when I'm done with a set and I'm officially done opening boxes from the set, I will um, go to a big warehouse with a wheel. No, I, I alphabetize the rares and mythics, put them into boxes and store them. Boom. Oh, kill the kid. No. It is the good one. It is the good foil. It is good to see, but it is not what we want. Surgical extraction. Kind of cool. Heartless conscription. Exile all... Eight? Exile all creatures for each card exiled this way. You may play that card for as long as it remains exiled. And may Ooh! Dirty. This is not the guy from before. This is Bristly Bill. How could we forget Bristly Bill? Whoa! Tyrant Scorn. Fierce Retribution. That man has a hole in his chest, but again, you know, we all need to pick our battles here. Ah, the Blood Hustler. That's fine. I'm sure she means well. I'm sure the blood gave consent. I cast Murder. Three, two, one. Textured. You owe me. Outlaws Merriment. Are they playing with fireworks? Vengeful Regrowth. One last job. I was going to make this uh, a commander. Shouts out, Will Neff. Boom! Ooh, we have not pulled one of these yet. If you like Wilhelm, you gotta try Grimgrin. Tell me about him. Sell me on him. Sand Scout. Oh! This is our guy! Oh, you can get this in the crazy foil? Oh, that's probably got so much value. Oh, he looks so different here. Still good hit. Great hit, even. Claim Jumper. Okay, Claim Jumper is like a cowboy restaurant here in San Diego. I used to think, like, when I was a kid, that was like... Oh, you just graduated high school? We're going to claim jumper, bro. You earned it. Chili's, we got too much money for that. We're going to claim jump. We're going to claim jumper. Now, I've been to claim jumper a little more recently, and I'm like, damn, it's kind of dog water. Does it still exist? It does. Ha noon. I like this card. Each player can't cast more than one spell this turn, and you can sack it, deal five damage to every player. I think that's kind of cool. Uh, claim jumper, super mid now, though. Sandstorm Salvager. There's a sh there's a um, card in here called Raise the Dead or something. I I, I want to if we see it I want to read it to you. I really like what it does. Skullcrack got hit by the fling guy. I noticed that. I noticed that. Treasure. Uh, okay, it's a pony. <laughs> what is this? A game for women? <laughs> Fell the mighty. Excuse me. Bounty board. Don't care. Oh, we're getting so many of these. Legion extruder. Next. Uh, poop. Next. Don't care. All right. Yep. We've been there. Come on. Bounty board is really good flavor. Next time I pull it, I'll read it. Mostly chain restaurants are owned uh, by private equity now. Is that why they suck? Boom. Oh, unlicensed hearse. Exile two target cards from a single graveyard. Unlicensed hearse power is equal to, are, are each equal to the number of cards exiled with it. Ugh, is this good? Is it? I don't know. I feel so not impressed with um, vehicles ever. Ever. Holy Marsh. Ha noon. Thornado. Land. Three, two, one. Oh, duels of the mind. You don't have any texture. Crackle with power. Still a good card. Embrace the unknown. This is cool. Exile the top two cards of your library until the next turn. You may put a lot of like playing from exile in this set. Outcast or Trailblazer. Is he riding a giant lizard? Tarnation Vista. This is a good card, I believe. Okay, I read this card and I go, this is really good. But I also go, what deck do I put this in? No, it's not. It's a very bad card. Dude, the, the difference in chat just went, this is a banger card. This is a terrible card. 
It's like a worse bloom tender. It's terrible. Give it to me. Oh, okay. That's valid. Th that's the thing, though. I will admit, I thought it was a good card, and then I sat here holding it the other day, and I went, what deck do I even put this? I'm like, ah, it doesn't work there. It doesn't work there. It's mid. Have you pulled a Ram Ranch yet? You get 18 one, one human creature. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm looking for it right here. This was the last pack, by the way. This was a very mid box. This is, I love the new Path to Exile. Looks sick. Ew, a thieving varmint. Rush of Dread. Step Between Worlds. That's it. This was the box. See, look at that. That's what could happen, boys. Don't gamble. As the boxes continue, the degeneracy is only going to go up. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, you get fooled, you can't get fooled again. Trent Eyes, 3, 2, 1. <sighs> Stupid bitch. Oh! No, why can't you? Oh, I can't be mad. I can't be mad. It's Mana Drain. I can't be mad at a Mana Drain. It's not the foil texture. Mana Drain's banger. Best counter spell ever printed. <sighs> Damn, it's like getting teased. I just got my dick. Ah! Oh, this is such a tease pack. I cannot come. There is no... Oh, God. I am in terminal agony. I am repulsed. I am island. Good pack. Chase card teases. Really, though. Do not come. Now it's going to get real, Degen, because now it owes me big time. Ah! Oh, Contagion Engine. Great card. I use this in my Atraxa deck. Villainous Wealth. And don't worry, my Atraxa deck is not cringe. This is my Goro Goro deck. My Atraxa deck is not cringe. It's a Planeswalker deck. I don't use Atraxa for all your cringe shit. I don't infect. It's a Planeswalker deck. It's fun. If you lose to my Atraxa deck, literally skill issue. To lose to a Planeswalker deck is so simply your fault. I'm calling you out. Sorry. You are simply ignoring the board state 24-7. Uh, so anyway, guys, Tiny Bones, is it a baby? I think we really need an answer on that. Like now. Three, two, one. This me. Reanimate, banger. It looks like his anterior fontanelle has closed, meaning he is at least over a year old. But by the looks of the skull, it looks more like an adult skull. That being said, I have no idea what the intentions of the artist were, so I'm just going going with your hypothesis that this is a skeleton baby. <laughs> I do appreciate the uh, the medical examination of Tiny Bones, but I don't like that you kind of left it open to interpretation. Babies can't chew kids size clothing. What are you guys look at the goddamn baby bones? Is it a baby? Damn it. We literally pulled this card. Not a bad card, but still dust bowl hitting the old dusty trail. Dead before sunrise. Marchessa. Don't care. Duels of mine. We've seen you. Thornado and land. How about this? Interpret this texture foil right here. Ah, smuggler surprise. I don't care about a Trojan Hell or Void rend. This card is difficult to look at. Angel of Indemnity. There, oh, there it is, boys. Here is the most Omega cringe card in the whole set. If you made a commander deck with this, you're boring. I can smell the person who saw this and went, yeah. Uh, let's read what she does. She has Menace. Whenever, first off, the color combo of this. What is it called? Grixis, that's what it is. Literally the filthiest combo. Okay, whatever. Whenever Obeka Splitter of Seconds deals combat damage to a player. She has Menace, by the way, so you know that's going to be happening. You get that many additional upkeep steps after this phase. It's just, it's just cringe. It's just classic Obeka manipulating the game so you can play solitaire with yourself. Mill decks are not cringe. I'll say this. Oh, mill decks aren't cringe because they're frankly bad. Sacrifice three artifact tokens with different names. Search your library for an artifact card. Put on the battlefield. Oh, oh. is that good? That feels kind of good. Check this out though. Nope. Grindstone, good hit. Grindstone's All a good I'm card. saying is this. If you play a blue deck that counters and mills, you deserve to get bullied, you nerds. Three, two, one. Oh, oh, no! Oh, 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 we're so close. This is the closest we've been. So this is the foil showcase, but not the raised foil. Generous plunderer, what do you do? You have menace, human rogue. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may create a treasure token. Hey, look at that! Obeka! Obeka! When you do, target opponent creates a tapped treasure token. Oh, so they don't even get the value. You can just keep going. Uh, whenever Generous Plunder attacks, it deals damage to defending player equal to the number of artifacts they can... Oh my god. Outlaw's Mirrorment. Crackling Spell Slinger. This is cool. It's a good card. When Crackling Spell Slinger enters the battlefield, if you cast it, the next instant or sorcerer you cast this turn has Storm. There's our bristly bill. Concealed Courtyard. 
Bristly Bill is like 20 bucks right now. That's not bad. We'll get, here we go. Watch this. Give me more. I love coming out with sheer confidence for nothing. Dune Chanter. We're flying through these. Doom Chanter is kind of pog. Not as pog as this. Damn it. And just looking at this dumbass little lizard guy after saying that. Archive Trap again. Forger's Foundry. This is from the Fallout set. They slipped it in there. Botanical. Okay, cute little fuckable cat. Love to see it. Humiliate. Mountain. Next. The box has has been such a slap in the balls. Yeah, it hadn't been great. It hadn't been great, but that's okay. We keep going. Stay focused. Stay strong. Get ready. Etched foil. Three, two, one. Archive trap. If I have to look you in the eyes again, your bleeding little eyes, I'm going to scream. Anguish on making. Cool. Elemental eruption. You're not the terror dragon that I was looking for. Woobert, I'm working on painting an Age of Sigmar Night Haunt army, and it's insane how little I've got done in a week. My Warhammer army is painted and ready to go, and I will show you guys soon, actually. Boom! Oh, it's another good one. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Oh! Good card, but not the good card, but a good card. When Vaultborn Tyrant or another creature with power four enters the graveyard of the battlefield under control, you gain three life and draw a card. That's absurd. Uh, when Valborn Tyrant dies, if it's not a token, create a token that's a copy of it, except it's an artifact in addition to its other types. This is such a good card for, yes, such a good dino card. Life gain dinosaur, you know it. Good card. I'd love to see it. Here we go. Three, two, I'm gonna close my eyes. I'm, gonna, I'm just looking at I just got here, Wubby. Right. Can you put all the cards back Anything in the good? packs and start again? Is it good, chat? Yo. Oh! It is good. It's the worst Oko though, unlucky. All right, thanks, idiot. I'm saying, oh, this. I I'm gonna throw this card in a deck. I don't care where. It's just this is so ridiculous. Um, back for more, and that's it. All right, all right, guys, we're all out of packs. I hope you guys enjoyed the opening. I had fun. I hope you had fun. This is oh, this is just I'm cleaning up the trash with this. That's it. That's all we got. Bye, everybody. See you Wednesday. Uh, all right, let's continue. Here we go. I tried school, bro. I dropped out harder than um, uh, than someone who drops out hard. Oh God, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Oh, I care. I care. Great hit. Very playable hit. Not exactly what we were looking for. Shadow sword. Such a good sword. Don't even. Hmm. Hmm. We take it. Good start. Is it a good start or is it blowing your load early? It's going in a bunch of my decks. It really should. Is this a sign of things to come, or did we blow our load early? I don't know. It's hard to tell. But the two back-to-back -back big hits and two back-to-back -back packs. Uh, this is. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Is it a good box, or is it over now? And we got loot, and you get to see the art that made the internet very mad. The slot is hot. Loot the key to everything with his dumb little punchable face. Keep gambling let's get it why did it make the internet mad i can i be honest with you i don't know hot slot here we go come on uh, hot slot come on come on hot slot here we go come on hot slot ice cold people just thought it was some cringe digimon looking art man that sucks for the poor artist who made that shit hot slot here we go come on boom oh mind slaver it's okay that's okay Okay, baby, you gotta be nice. Ah. I see the, the art here and I freak the f out. I freak the oh, I thought this was Terror of the Peaks. It was not. Chat, let's 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 wine and dine this next pack. Oh. Chat, give it up. Y'all can't analyze these little eyes. Let's treat ourselves to a real Dejan box. Mm. <clears throat> I think I may have won. Oh, it's me! It's a dwarf warlock. Tiny bones. What do you guys think? Baby? Oh. 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 Whenever a quick creature deals combat damage, put a charge counter on this bitch. Remove a charge counter from this bitch. Choose one. Untap target land. Target creature can't block. Put a plus one counter on a quick creature. Don't want to derail Magic Monday, but I went to urgent care this morning. Got an x-ray before the doc twisted my busted shoulder till I screamed. After that, he left and never came back. My discharge papers have upper arm pain and swelling as my okay. diagnoses. 
I couldn't stop thinking. I'm sorry. <laughs> this was a good pack. This was a good pack. I would say we've had decent pulls. We hit the sword, but we haven't. Uh, Jay's telling you to play him for real, though, bro. Hey, Come on. Wubs, how do you hey. rank the big villains? Talking Eldrazi, Nicole Bola, Phyrexians, and Slivers. How do I rank them? I, that's I oh, there's rest in peace. I love this card. I want to show you guys this. I love this card. When it enters the battlefield, exile all graveyards. If a card will be put into a graveyard, exile it instead. I love this card. I love the art for it. I love the flavor for it. It's so good. I love it. I can't wait for it. Ooh, generous plunder again. It's such good graveyard hate. Oh my God. Yeah. Damn, Torpor Orb, we're getting pretty. This is a good box. Torpor Orb, I love the look of it. This is not cancer, guys. This goes right into Kozilek. It goes right into Kozilek. Discreet Retreat. Botanical Sanctum. Sanctum. Pillaged Bog. Back from, oh. Uh. Is that a good guy or a bad guy on your shoulder? A good guy. Check out this though. Boom. I ought to just do the world a favor and crumple this card up right now. Overwhelming forces, good. Embrace the unknown. Still no Terror of the Peaks. Unlucky, no Terror of the Peaks. Why do we hate Obeka? Because I th feel like Obeka is just such, is just, the mechanic is cringe to me. It's just an opinion, man. Void Slime, Dead Before Sunrise, Railway Brawler, Murder. I just don't like the type of magic Obeka plays because he hates my Obeka deck. Not, can I be honest? I don't even hate your Obeka deck. I, I don't hate your Obeka deck as much as I hate your fucking gr mono green. What is that thing called? Silvala. I'm going to go through all my friends right now, and I'm going to say one deck that needs to be banned from the table for each friend. Peanut, Silvala. Carlos, Carlos being at the table. Um, I'm going to say for me, you can ban Kozilek. I'll give you that. That's so fair. Check out this, though. I think Carlos might be the king of just like stealing everyone's ideas. <laughs> and I see the thing is, I don't, I'm saying this, and this is like, well, hey, you don't, do you want this to get back to Carlos? I'm saying this publicly in the hopes that he's listening. Carlos is the yoinkiest and twistiest person at the whole table. Let me explain here. All right. Carlos yoinks and twists. Here's how it always goes somebody gets a new deck, a week goes by, Carlos comes back with a new deck. Your commander will be in his deck, but his deck will be a little bit better. No, well, no, because we're not actually mad about it. All that it really means is more decks at the table. Well, we forgot to do more, bo no more boxes bit. I don't even care anymore. We're in this now. I'm going to go real degen. We're going to, I don't even, look at this. I don't even have time to look at these cards. They're going to be blurry. If this makes it to the highlight video, Ryan, just go crazy with it. Put something on screen, something, something graphic. Titties right here. Titties, boom. <clears throat> don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. No more time for bits. We're in full degen mode. You guys wanna see like actual degen? I'll show you. Watch this. It gets bad when I stop separating the lands. <clears throat> nope, I'm just looking for set symbols now. <laughs> I'm gonna be sitting down tonight. We haven't played magic in a minute, by the way. I'm gonna be sitting down with my new zombie deck. I give Carlos 14 days before there's some sort of zombie on the other side of the table. <laughs> it's just known, you know, it's just gonna happen. Boom. That's okay though. I don't, um, I don't actually have any ill will. How's the studio coming along? It's great. Um, I actually showed it to my nurse today. My nurse came in. My nurse was like, asked me, he's like, oh, you got a lot of magic cards here. And I'm like, oh yeah, you play? He's like, yeah, I just started getting into it. And I was like, yo, we actually have like a studio we're making. And he wanted to go see it. And I took him out and showed it. And he was like, he was like, this is the coolest room I've ever seen. Dude. I'm like, oh my God, thank you. We worked really hard. Oh, Prismatic Vista. This is from the list. This is a big hit. Jesus, criminy! It's a good hit! I don't know how much it actually is going for, but it's a great hit. Trash card? What do you mean trash card? Mid? What year is it that we're that we hate Prismatic Vista? Am I like really behind? Man, y'all some it's just alcohol. Oh rest in peace. I love the showcase. Oh, it's so good. Jim Cornucopia. Ella Schnorn is my waifu. She's good. Boom! Oh, no! Why? Oh! Ah! We still take those. Oh, it's not bad. I really can't be mad about it. Oh, it's just so close. It's not textured for those. Who, here, I'll just show you the difference here. It's not textured. And here's, this is what we wanted. 60 bucks. That's not bad. That's a... Oh! God! What a pack. Keep it going. 
Keep it going. Hot pack for sure. That's fine. All right. All heroes must fade. That's fine. What a pack though. Damn. So what did we pull tonight that was big? We pulled one textured. We pulled a sword. We pulled a couple mana drains. We pulled a lotus foil showcase, but not the sketch or the etched foil. We still have time. We still have chances. Okay. Okay. I don't know what this one goes for, but again, rare. Hello, special guest. So okay. would now be a good time to get into magic? Always a good time to get into magic, man. Sacrifice any number of lands. Search your library for that many land cards. Put them on the battlefield tab. That is such a good way to get out your basic sh Huge. We like that. What the f***? That's such a beautiful card. Yeah, bro. It's so good. Games Mischief. Embrace the unknown. Ha! Ah, memory Vessel! Hello? Memory Vessel. Stoic Sphinx. Still no Tear of the Peaks. Last pack of Thunder Junction. Here we go. Every cowboy needs a hat. I'm just going to straight up drop the bottom card without trying to feel it at all. Okay. Dropped. Here we go. Void Slime. Dog shit. Dog shit. Oko. Dog shit. We only have one card left, and I can feel it. There is no texture on this card. Gorilla Penis. Bro, every member of the Wiggles personally has cornered me and f***ed the shit out of me. 